Hi, I'm Stacey Harris, and you have tuned into your networking image where I get to interview my amazing Network in Action members. And today, we are here with Miss Hannah Hoskins. And Hannah has been a member with us for a few months now, and um, but I have known her for a very long time, and I can tell you how incredibly talented she is. Hannah has a business called Statement Looks, and she is a makeup artist as well as a personal trainer. And uh, so Hannah, I just want to kind of start out and have you tell us a little bit about how you got started in makeup and then we'll talk about your personal training stuff, okay? Yeah. Um, so I fell in love with makeup at a very early age and um, been playing with it since I was 15. And at 17, I booked my first makeup job for a, um, of all things, like a lingerie fashion show. <laughs> and so that was a lot of fun. And um, after that, I wanted to make a career out of it. So I made sure that I um, got my license and wanted to build a business as an independent freelance artist and have been doing it ever since. I've been licensed since 2007. Who is a good client for you? I like a wide variety of people to work with. Um, currently, most of my clientele are, are brides, um, but I like to sit down with people who are confused about a makeup routine, not knowing what colors to choose for themselves or what kind of looks to play with or just want to practice their technique. So um, the person that's looking for a new routine to someone who has a wedding or a headshot they want to take for business photos, um, special events, every from small to big, everything in between. After you had your daughter, um, you got into physical fitness big time. And so tell us about that transition, how you've made that into part of your business as well. Well, so like most people do, I gained weight with having a child, and after uh, months of post-baby, I was unhappy with my body, not that I was in horrible shape, but it was just a size I was not used to being in, and I was considered overweight at the time, and um, I wanted to change, so I started with baby steps, and started with the food journal, and started counting my calories and doing it that way. Then I discovered intermittent fasting, love that and because I come from back, a background of binge compulsive eating so for me fasting really helped me and still helps me manage those urges and um, I really like to share that with people who have the same struggles because it's one of those things where people see me and they assume that I probably don't know what it's like to not be athletic or to have any kind of eating problems but I like to share that with people like I come from a place like that so if we do it step by step and systematic there's no reason why you can't achieve your goals and then I found weightlifting and that's when it really exploded for me the fitness thing. Yeah. And I want y'all to look at her arms. Do a little bicep curl for us so we can see her arms. She's got the best arms ever. And um, so she definitely practices what she preaches. And for a lot of people, personal training, it can be a little bit intimidating walking into a gym full of people, especially if you haven't worked out in a long time. Um, so I really love the setup that you have because you are truly a personal trainer. So tell everybody a little bit about that. Well, um, I do training in two ways. So I am freelance, so I don't work at a gym. I don't work for anybody. Um, I have a place where in my home, I have a room dedicated full of fitness equipment for those that are looking to train um, out of home. And then there are people who get in-home gyms and they just end up collecting dust or they just are worried about using the equipment. They're scared of getting injured. So if they have a place already set up in their own home, I will travel to them and work them out in their home. Yeah. Tell us a little bit about who do you like to work with and maybe one of your success stories. Um, I like to work with pretty much everybody, but there's one thing, that an age group that 40 and up they don't complain. It's the youngsters that, you know, <laughs> the, the, you know, 30 and below that tend to huff and puff and complain and not want to, but you know, I've had 55 year olds where, um, they just get in there and they get it done and they don't make a peep and it's, and it's awesome. But, um, so I have a soft spot for that age group, but I like okay. to work with everybody. But, um, the success stories really come from the, the client's dedication. So I, I'm only as successful as my client will allow me to push them. So if you're thinking about making a change in your life and getting in shape, and getting the body that you really want. Um, I want to encourage you to get in touch with Hannah Hoskins at Statement Looks. Her contact information will be on the screen. If you would like to meet Hannah in person, then we would really love for you to come and visit us at one of our Network in Action meetings. Thank you so much for watching these videos. Please remember that if you enjoy what you have watched, if you will like and share it, you are helping a local business owner grow her business. And we really do appreciate that. Thanks so much again, and we'll see you next time.